How's it going, everyone? Lucian Sword here, playing some more Brawl Hollow for you today. As always, hope you're all having a beautiful day wherever you might be. Uh, what are we doing in Strikeout? Actually, let's go back to uh, regular 1v1. All right, so we're going to be continuing the Brawl Hollow Wheel of Legends series. And with that, let's go ahead and bring up the wheel. All right, so the first three episodes, we did Azoth. Then we did Reno, and then we did Mordex. So those three names have been taken off the Wheel of Legends. We have 54 legends remaining. Who will be the final legend? Who knows, but we're actually going to do something a little different today. Normally, you guys know who the legend is, but today you don't because I've been getting a lot of people commenting. I should not put the legend in the thumbnail or title or anything so you guys can you know be surprised with me so here we go enjoy being surprised with me on who the legend is gonna be let's do it the brawlhalla wheel of legends who will be chosen will it be who it's gonna be i'm gonna guess Ezio. no nix volkov Oh, that's so exciting. I love Volkov. Why, wait, why is the text like highlighted? Okay. <laughs> Dude, I love Volkov. All right, cool. All right, so Volkov's actually one of my favorite legends, so that's awesome. The question is, which skin do we want to use in our first game? Um, I think I have every Volkov skin. Let's see, how many skins does he have? One, two, three, four. Five. I only have five Volkov skins. I think that's all of them, but um, all right, so let's do I want to save Huntsman Volkov for last because that's my favorite one. So let's do Red Romance Volkov. This is one from the uh, Valentine's Day event. So I feel like we got to go love struck colors. He's got the heart on the axe, the heart on the scythe. And uh, do we have I'll do um, this dude. <laughs> Mr. Cetus. And uh, for a stance, we're just going to go strength. Full car. Wish me luck, guys. Going in a little bit rusty. As in, I've only played like a couple games this morning to warm up. But uh, yeah, should be a fun episode. And if you enjoy, please don't forget to drop a like. And if you enjoy Brawlhalla content, definitely subscribe because I'm always putting it out there. All right, we're going against a Mordex, our first game Three, with two, Volkov today. One, Let's go. Scythe versus Scythe. A classic matchup. Yeah, better watch that one, boy. I said you better watch that one, boy. And that one. Oh, I thought he would actually get back, but I guess not. All right. We're going to put that bomb away right now. Where are you going, Volkov? Where? Oh, no, I mean Mordex. I shouldn't, I shouldn't taunt myself. Oh, oh. Oh my goodness! What a recovery. I was like trying to do an axe ground pound. I had the positioning, but... He just had that on lockdown. Oh, goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Bye bye, Modex. Like I said, Volkov, one of my favorites. Doesn't mean I'm like the best with him. I just like playing him. Nah, I'm not gonna fight Gauntlets over there. Nice side sig. Ha! 
How does my downlight not reach, but his does? Come on. Oh, I thought I had a dodge or something. Nope. All right. Final stocks, guys. We got to do it. We got to do it, Volkov. Bye bye. Yeah. GG, dude. GG. Well played. First game with Volkov is a win. Well, uh, well played, dude. Well played. All right. So let's see who we got played next. We got Rocker, Volkov. We got Blood Moon. Hmm. Yeah, let's do Rocker Volkov. Oh, I like this one a lot, but different color. Uh, let's do Soulfire. Nah, let's do Synthwave. Synthwave is like, you know, musical, I guess. And this is a musical-ish legend, I guess. The, the axe, I really don't think it looks that good, to be honest. But I guess we'll just keep the weapons just because it goes with the skin. Any Volkov mains out there in the audience? Drop a comment. Let me know. Show us your Volkov pride. Represent Volkov gang. All right, here we go. Going against a Sidra. Ooh, Sidra is such an annoying legend to fight against. Don't you guys agree? Like the cannonballs, the, the cannon itself, the sword, all annoying. Look, look at that. Look at that. That That is exactly what I'm talking about. Swept her right off of the stage. I guess she was already off the stage. I do like the site though. The musical keyboard site is pretty cool. Lucky I did not get you there, Sidra. And we are well, well on our way to this victory. I seem to have her number. What? Did you guys hear the, the sound effect of the bomb blowing up, but it actually didn't blow up? Now's your chance, Sidra. I'm deep red. There you go. That was actually a very nice down air. Reanimation. We actually have such a massive lead that we can afford to lose this stock completely and still be fine. You know what I mean? All right, that's game. GG, dude. When in doubt, Axe Ground Pound, 360 degrees of death. Well played, dude. Well played. No rematch, I guess. All right, that was, uh, that was a pretty good game. Let's do... I feel like nobody likes Blue Virus uh, Volkov. Let me know, like, is there a single soul out there that actually likes this skin? I mean, the only thing I actually love about this skin... I mean, I don't think it's the worst skin in the game. Don't get me wrong. And on this color, it actually looks sick. But the best part about the skin are the weapons. I actually love the weapons. Um, it's like the main reason I bought the skin. All right, going against Isaiah. All right. I like that Isaiah skin. Looking forward to the day we actually get to play Isaiah on this series, too. All right, Volkov, three, don't fail me now. Two, we won the one, first two games four. pretty good. Let's see if we can win number three. All right. Uh, 
watch out, Volkov. Or I mean, <laughs> I keep saying that, Isaiah. I don't think I've landed a single axe neutral sig like this video, so that's gonna be my personal challenge. Land an axe neutral sig. That's actually a hard move to hit sometimes on Volkov. Nice try. Oh my goodness, that one worked though. Did not expect the double. Gotta give him credit. The double ground pound was, was a good play. Worth. Bro, <laughs> no, Isaiah, not like that. Oh, man. Don't feel bad. You know how many times I've died the same way? Hitting the bottom of the stage, you know? You, you try to jump to get back, and instead you just hit bottom of the stage. That move right there is like one of the best edge guard moves in the world because I'm so safe when I do it, and yet it's hard to not hit for them, you know what I mean, kind of? All right, all right, bro. I'm not gonna die that way. GG, dude, GG, well played. Player two wins. I guess this skin isn't so bad. All right. Um, yeah, this is probably going to be our last game. So we'll go to Huntsman Volkov Black, of course. I'll just leave the weapons default for now. Volkov. But since it's our last game, let's switch up the sidekick. Let's do this guy. Tang Young Nostr and Tang Rings Ningenegabagger. For real though, Volkov is one of my favorite legends. Like he's just got that style, you know, he's got that swagger, he's got the axe and the scythe, two of the best weapons in the game. Three, two, You're kidding if you think one, they're not. Roll. And we're going against Blue Beat. I have a feeling they just want to get right into the battle. I'm not forgetting about that neutral sig. I, I want to hit it. Oh, do it again. I want to counter like that. She kind of bullying us with that sword. Oh, I hit it, but only I hit like half of it. So I don't know if that'll count. Maybe I got to hit both hits like boom, boom. You know what I mean? Maybe right here? Oh. Guess not. She always goes low instead of going high, which makes it like hard to hit that neutral sig. Every time I hit her or anything, she dodges down. Don't get too close. Oh. Bro, what? Not like this. Not like <laughs> blue. <sighs> what? What? We will just assume that um, they had to go to school or something. Like, I have no idea, man. Maybe they just really don't like going against Scythe. I know that happens to a lot of people, but I think if that's uh, if you're watching a video and you you do this kind of behavior where you disconnect when you're getting bodied, um, you know, nothing against you, but like. If, if you're getting dominated against Scythe, my recommendation is to learn how to play Scythe. Play Scythe Legends if that's what you're getting destroyed by. Because by learning the weapon, you're going to learn what Scythe users try to do. You know what I mean? How they play. Let's play one more game. That one was kind of lame. Uh, let's do Blood Moon. And we're going to do like a red looking... Actually, that one looks pretty cool. 
Uh, you know what? I, I haven't even used Gold Forge yet. It looks kind of weird with Gold Forge on this skin, but we'll do it. But yeah, learn the weapon. Trust me, it works. I know you're probably like, never. I never want to learn a weapon. I hate it so much. Everyone that plays it is just like the worst person. No, don't take it personally. Don't take it emotionally. Don't take it. I like, guess none of that. Just learn the weapon. You're going to learn how to avoid it. Don't get me wrong. Scythe is a really tough weapon to face, especially if they're good with it. I get bodied by Scythe, a good Scythe user, too. But... Good. He dodges up. Maybe we can actually hit this. Ooh, he keeps jumping up. Complete opposite of that last player we were going against. Yes! I hit the Scythe neutral sig, guys! Normally it's like the easy move to hit, but for some reason not today. No! I thought for sure I would hit that down air, but I killed myself thinking that. Always gotta have a backup plan. Boom, I hit the double neutral. My life is complete. That's a good move, but don't over rely on it. It's kind of funny when you kill with using a ground pound, but you kill off the ceiling. You know what I mean? That's pretty funny. Not too many ground pounds can do that, but axe, not a problem. Bye bye. You're going to die by the scythe and you're going to die by the axe. Uh-uh, Diana. I know how Diana players work. I, I love Diana. That was good. Oh, I thought she would jump up again, but I guess not. Oh, that was good. Good read, Diana. I forgot how strong and fast that blaster ground pound can be. Right when they're feeling safe, like uh, they think I'm just gonna go for that weapon, that's when I turn around and boom. Uh-uh, get off of here. GG dude, GG. Alright, that's going to be it for Volkov. Hope you guys enjoyed the Volkov content. It was fun to play Volkov. I always enjoy playing Volkov. Like I said, one of my favorite legends. But unfortunately, Volkov's name is now removed from the Wheel of Legends. And we will not play him again in this series. Anyways, hope you enjoyed. Please drop a like if you did. Be sure to subscribe for the... Brawlhalla content and uh, yeah, let me know who you think the next Wheel of Legends will be if if you get it right uh, I guess that makes you really cool. Anyways, this is Lucian Sword. Hope to see you in the next one. Take it easy friends